Hey everybody, so new update for the winter freezer. I've had it for a few months now and I figured I would do a little update on it. Uh, I have moved with it. Darn movers dimmed it up. I don't know if the camera can actually see that. My only complaint would be because it's stainless steel, it is a fingerprint magnet. I just wiped it all down before the video, of course, but uh, it does look pretty, it really does. Now this freezer isn't one of the biggest ones out there, of course, but I think it's a good size and I like stand-up freezers just because it makes it so much easier. I've, I had a chest freezer for the last 15 years and finally before this one and uh, digging around in a chest freezer is just not fun. But as you can see, you do got your daylight LED, so it is nice and modern. You get more of a, a brighter color or a brighter light. You do get several shelves where you could put a lot of stuff on there. And uh, you also have a basket at the bottom, which we kind of just throw our bags of vegetables and different things there. And then of course you got storage in the door, several shelves there. And it does store a decent amount of stuff. I also kind of double it up by doing magnetic hooks and keeping different things on there. Since it's out in the garage, kind of makes it easier there too. All right, now I'll give you a closer look at the control panel here. Now, the other thing I didn't mention is that you can change this from freezer to fridge. So you can use this as a refrigerator as well. Now you can't do both at the same time, of course, but if you ever wanted to do that, you can. I use it for just freezer and uh, it'll give you a little dot. So depending on which one you choose, it will have a dot for that one. So the dots on the top for the freezer, you could also lock it which I just unlock it so I can show you some different things, but you can lock it so just little bumps won't change it. And then you can change the temperature, like right now we're at zero. I'll go ahead and turn that lock off, I thought I did. But we're at zero temperature and you can adjust it to whatever temperature you actually want. I just keep mine at zero, that's just for preference. You also have a quick freeze. The quick freeze will make it negative 11. Uh, what I did is I did a quick freeze when I went to move and that way everything was still really nice and solid frozen when I got to my move three hours later. And so you just, you click that and it'll do negative 11 for the next 24 hours. Now I'm not gonna do it because I don't really need it, but that is an option for you. Also, another thing that this will do is uh, when the door is open, if it's open for too long, it will start beeping at you and it will also light up door open and all of that. And also it will let you know if your temperature gets too high, the nice little alarm there. But uh, anyway, if you're looking for a nice freezer, this one has been great. And uh, I mean, you can also double up as the fridge, like I mentioned, it's not something I'm gonna use personally. I don't need it as a fridge, but I really like this freezer and it has been a great purchase for me.